Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome. My name, of course, is Obit Potato. This is Don't Starve Together. He's Rhapsody. Uh, we're coming out of a nightmare fuel sort of high, I guess. At the moment, mm -hmm. we've been farming nightmare fuel for the last episode or whatever. It's pretty good. We're in a pretty decent position, I think, even with all the nightmare stuff that we had to endure. Um, what's the status? Give me a status update, man. Okay, status so, update. Status update. We need to fight the pig king. Fight the pig king? Fucking man. Find what the fuck? The pig king. Oh, thank Jesus Christ. Ooh. So, did you find many trinkets while you were digging stuff up? Uh, I found a shoehorn. I found an air unfreshener. Uh, shit you like that. I just. Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, so, anything you uh, think the pig king might take, I'm going to go and look for the pig king and see if I, I can give him those. Yeah, all right. Do you not want to wait until summer? Is that not a little bit more of a safer bet? Well, I'm. I mean, there's nothing really to do in winter. In summer, we've got all of the farming and stuff that we need to do. I think the best time to yeah. do it is in winter. All right. Well, you know, you know, knock knock your heart out, knock your heart different out. Strokes for different folks on that one, but um. But where am I going to be leading? This? Yeah, shit. We're we're almost out of food, man. We're almost out of food. We've, you we've say got that no like food. It's a problem. It is the, the real problem, actually. Yeah. Now that you mention oh, it. Shit. Uh, yeah. No, we are running out of food. That's why you have to go for the qualifying today. That's your. Oh mission. yeah. Where is it? Oh, up at the top of the world. Oh shit. There's there's two. So one of them is up at the top of the world. I can tell you that much. All right. I'll go up. I'll go up, and I'll try and find it. B e a u t full. Okay. Um. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just sort of thinking, we've... It's going to take a while. <laughs> we've done the nightmare fuel stuff. We don't need to go any more insane. Uh, there should be loads of nightmare stuff back at the, back at the camp. Mm -hmm. I might be able to... If I murder beardlings, will they give me nightmare fuel? No, it's still a rabbit. Yep. Oh, shit. No, it's still rabbits. All right. Ah oh, shit. This right. this could if be you risky do actually. It, we'll give it to you, so that's that's a good idea. That will always be a good idea. I am having difficulty finding things that will heal me. That's my main problem right now. Yeah, well I'm I'm on thirty five health, to be honest, and uh it's kinda risky. But it's okay. I'll fight the qualifant for you. Tell me how close I am. You pretty close? Do you think I'm pretty I found it. I, I, found I got it. All right. I found it. It's it's all good. Okay. Up your head up, mole buddy. Okay, corner of the world. Oh fuck's sake. Koala koala -fant, more like a koala cunt, am I right? Yeah, you're right. Good work. That's a really good pun. I am trying my hardest to find absolutely any food whatsoever, and it is not forthcoming, I'll be entirely honest with you. I, I can't even catch this qualifant. I'm, I'm, I'm killing I'm moles. That's how, that's how desperate I am. I'm killing moles. Wow. I'm also gonna try and get some turkey, some uh, some gobbler. Alright, oh, come on, come on, you dickhead! Come on! You trying to get, trying to get the koala okay, cornered so you yeah. can actually attack him? Yeah. Yeah. This is absolutely the most painful thing I think I've ever done. Mhm. Mm well, wait until you give birth, or little. Jeez. Wow. All right. One shot. You were what? He one-shotted me. How? He one -shot what health were you on? Uh, like 35. And he, like, straight up attacked, like, rather than getting stunlocked, like I totally expected him to do. It's all right. No, I he mean, gets stunlocked a... for six attacks, and then you have to dodge. I I've told you that, the dip and weave. Yeah, no, no, no. I know it's six attacks, but he, like, just straight up attacked me, like, on attack one, which kind of threw me a little bit. 
Look, it's fine. Look, there's a life-giving amulet right here. So I'm just going to haunt it when daytime comes around. And I'm going to be back to, like, something, I guess. Is that, like a, is that a great plan or what? Tell me it's not a I'm great plan. I'm going to get killed, yeah. I'm dead. What? I couldn't drop... How are you I dead? Couldn't I had my torch. I couldn't drop it out, though. I had my torch in my inventory, but I couldn't draw it. What? So you've got the life-giving amulet. I'm going to go to the touchstone. Yeah, all right. Good shit. Fuck Like, me. I had the torch made in my inventory, but I had so many things in my inventory that I needed to drop something on the ground. And then while I was trying to drop something on the ground, uh, it was taking so long that um, that I got killed. And I am going to blame it taking so long on lag, although entirely possible it wasn't. Yeah. <laughs> That, well, that's good that, you know, you've got somebody to blame. Uh, are you going to manage to get to the touchstone before the night ends, or... Before uh, the night I'm gonna, ends? Uh, before, well, before maybe? the world resets, should I say. But, I, mean, I mean, the world's not going to reset. Yeah, exactly. I'm, I'm, next, to the, to I'm the next to the amulet. amulet. I'm next to it, but I don't want to spawn into it in the evening. If if I'm right next to a qualifant that could potentially kill me. Okay, that's a fair point. Well, I mean, Although the, I will, the world will resetting is going to take more than 55 seconds. Sorry, the, the getting to morning is going to take more than 47 seconds. So the world will yeah. reset unless one of us resets themselves. Da -da, da -da, da -da 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 -da. Are you going to make it? I think you're going to make it. I have faith. I'm trying to get there. But, I mean, I'm just going to die as soon as I get back to life. Because I'll die due to the darkness. Yeah, that's a good point. We should probably try and equip the touchstone with, uh, with some kit. Mm-hmm. All right, good luck, amigo. It's now or never. I wish thee well. Resurrected. I'm dead again. <laughs> that reset the timer. <laughs> I, mean, I, I, was, I told cracking. you that was going to happen. It's literally yeah, yeah no we, knew, we knew it was going to happen. We knew it was going to happen. And there is a life-giving amulet up here, so we got two life-giving amulets, which is kind of dope. Um, so I guess yeah, come up, come up and visit me, buddy. Um, and this should mean that we, well, at least one of us is going to be fine. And because one of us is going to be fine, we're both going to be fine, as far as I'm concerned. Mm -hmm. We've got nothing to worry about. Um, I'm just curious to see what the life-giving amulet puts your health at. Because that's probably something of a concern. If it's uh, kind of low. It should give you the standard, um, standard. Just 50% yeah. or whatever, yeah. Yeah, 50 50 Alright, life giving Almost amulet. Dead. Yep. I cannot Here believe that juggling stuff in my inventory killed me. Life giving amulet. Brings me back from the dead. So, I'm coming over here. Oh! I'm on 10 HP. <laughs> I'm on 10 HP. <laughs> Colin dead at least? No, he's not! He's not dead! Oh my he's alive! God. He's very much alive! <laughs> he's very much <laughs> chasing me! <laughs> I'm haunting him. Uh, I'm haunting him. Save, save me! I'm haunting him to distract you. Save I'm holding me. him to distract him from you. That is. Oh god! Oh god! I'm dead. Oh my god! <laughs> hey, look! You haunt the you haunt the spooky amulet, okay? And I will go to the touchstone. Uh, Where so is that don't amulet? actually die. Uh, there's another. Oh, it might be in the backpack. Oh no! <laughs> Yeah, well, you better make it to the other one, man. I need to get to the oh touchstone. Is, is this going to be the world's most unceremonious end? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. So, okay, you should probably come to the base as well. I mean, you or you can stay up there. Like, it literally doesn't matter, I guess. Yeah. I'm just going to wander around. <laughs> Am I going to make it? I think I'm going to make it. should be fine. Yeah, this should be alright. 
this this should be all right you know honestly even though we've burnt like six of our revivals in one episode i'm i'm Mm -hmm. i've got hopes i've got high hopes man really (laughs) yeah yeah high hopes i told you it's it's all about the healing and the fact that i'm unable to properly kite that's the real problem i mean i did kite him actually i did kite him for that little bit but um look where i am Examine touchstone. What? Haunt touchstone. Why can't I haunt this touchstone? Have you used it before? No. Are you sure? Why Why can't I haunt this touchstone? I'm haunting it. I'm haunting it. <sighs> Orbital, you have 15 seconds. I, I can't do a fucking thing! I can't. I, I actually can't. Like, it says Haunt Touchstone. Mm-hmm. Haunt Touchstone. I'm haunting it. I'm not doing anything. Is this a bug, or am I just completely missing the point? That Fuck! Really nice world. Fuck! Fuck! Fuck, 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 fuck. Can we roll back? Can we roll it back, or is that cheating? Is that... Is that something that you we can't what? do? That would be cheating. This is a survival game. Yeah. Pretty sure that would be cheating. Oh fuck, man! That was oh. So here's what we don't: we know our priorities better, and we oh. know what resources we need to prioritize better. Oh, so that sucks we're be so doing a lot hard. Better in this world, I feel. That sucks so hard. <laughs> I think you might want to change up your character because um, feeding Wolfgang was becoming a little bit of an issue, and we're not going to be able to get yeah. the of hunger as early as we'd like. So maybe you want to yeah. go another. Like combat focused character like Vigrid or someone. Yeah, you know what? Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's change it up. Let's get another combo wombo going if we can. Mm-hmm. Um what about like a a, a Vigfried Wix combo? That could be kinda cool. Or the spider guy. Fuck the spider guy, you know? Maybe a little bit I'm of cheeky spider, spider guy. guy. Uh that's clever. We would have fun. to set up separate we would have to set up separate bases, remember? That's why we didn't do I mean, it on stream. Not if we're both Weber. No, yeah, but then we have to learn an entirely new set of mechanics to play him. Yeah, you're right. What I think about? I want to prioritize surviving first. Oh man, we were doing so well, so well, mm-hmm. and we threw it all away in an evening of madness. No, no. <laughs> oh, you sound pretty salty. I'm not gonna lie. You sound pretty salty. I sound pretty salty. No, I'm happy because the chests are now fine. <laughs> right i can place them now oh, there's no salt yeah. about it yeah you're right I who are you I gonna might play go, i think i might go yeah. vicar bottom yeah I'm she's doing pretty her good. on a stream file as well but i'm doing her in a more combat orientated kind of thing whereas this will be quite good for making just like a really really early base what about maxwell who is maxwell cool Maxwell has some different mechanics. You basically spend your entire time going insane and fighting nightmare beasts. Oh, okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna go super combo wombo combat orientated. Mm-hmm. All right. Okay, so uh, look at these. Look at what? Up here. All right, I'm coming. I want you to know, by the way, that um. All of the farming that you're gonna do is now completely worthless. So, uh. Well, I mean. Good luck keeping me alive. Holy shit, petrified trees. Can we get rock from this? Yeah, I'd have to imagine so. You'd, uh. I, I don't know if you chop them down or mine them down. <laughs> I'm not so certain, but, uh. Yeah, they exist. It's good enough for me. That is kinda cool. And you know what? Now we don't have to, like. I, well, whatever her name is, Vigfried's damage doesn't scale with health, which is yeah. it's quite just nice. always there. You get always, HP always and sanity back whenever you kill a thing, uh, yeah. proportional to what you killed. So you do want to have things that you can actively kill at all times. Also, you might yeah. want to make like a hat to give to me so that I can uh, keep myself alive because that's like real good damage protection. Yeah, the uh, the battle the battle helm. That's super mm. cheap as well. Two gold, two stone. That is super nice. Man. Alright. Uh, you know what? Let's 
let's let's be honest, okay? It was mostly my fault fucking up. Um mostly my fault. But it's okay. I, I apologize, I apologize for fucking up. But we all make mistakes, man. We all make mistakes. Yeah. I'm I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We all make mistakes, especially you, I understand. When we started the series together, I... No, to I'm, be I'm fair, sorry, I, I did I did die when I definitely should not have died. <laughs> Like, yeah, I wasn't. I wasn't expecting you to die. Like, I, yeah, it was, uh, was, was kind of weird. I was juggling my event. To be fair, yeah, you know, I also. It's need, difficult. Need it's difficult with time. lag. Yeah, so that's yeah. uh, fine. I, you know what? Honestly, um, yeah, we were doing really well. There's nothing else I can say about that. Yeah, fuck me. Oh well. GG. Good game. So, what are you? What What are your grand plans for? Uh, for winning, winning the day here. What, give me, give me the okay. lowdown. So here's the download lowdown, right? What okay. we need is gold really early on, so I can just straight up make a alchemy machine immediately. Okay. All right. And Sounds good. I'll have that prototyped in my inventory for quite some time. I won't be using it for quite some time, but I'll prototype it, have it in my inventory, ready for when we find and find the base. As soon as we find, uh -huh. I think we might want to set up on a desert biome so we can get some uh, some new flavor into the mix. And the desert uh -huh. biome would give us basically the uh, what are they called? Tumble tumbleweeds. And those tumbleweeds yep. are going to be able to keep us entirely pip and top in terms of our twigs and our grass. Okay, so uh, straight away, I can tell you that I'm off to a pretty good start. I just managed to get us three silk, one healing gland. Uh, I also got some frog's legs and some fish by killing one mm -hmm. of the mermen. Whatever the fuck they're called. Mum. Mer. Well, you know, whatever. You know what I mean. No, that wasn't me correcting you. I was just pronouncing it. Um, oh, okay. Well, you know. Go fuck yourself, basically. Okay. Um, yeah. That's pretty much what I uh, what I meant there with that. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, no, I, I kind of uh, kind of figured that might have been what you meant when you said exactly that. <laughs> so, are we gonna lead separate lives uh, for a little bit while we go on a little bit of an explore? Yeah. I'm uh, gonna find uh, where we're gonna be setting up this base, and you are going to find everything else. No, you're just gonna <laughs> find things. Pretty much. All right. So the, the best it. thing I find with Vigfred is constantly finding ev like I'm, every single time. Yeah. Wallet and track. That's like, like priority I, numero yeah. uno. Yeah. I mean, like spiders. I'm already taking out spiders. I'm taking out spiders' nests because, quite frankly, if they're here, we might as well kill them for the silk because we're not going to come back. Like we can always find like a tier three later on if we want, but I'm just gonna if I see it, I'm gonna kill it. That's basically it. Okay. Um. And that should be fine. You know, also, another reason that I'm kind of glad uh, that the last world ended is because uh, it got to a point where we, we couldn't, re we didn't really have any comprehension of where the, uh, of where the pig king was. We didn't know where Glomer was. But now, now we've, now we've got a whole new world of potential, man. You know how exciting that is? New world. Yep. It's, it's hugely exciting. It's so exciting that I'm super excited. And you just uh, can't hide it? And I know, I know, I know, I know that you like it. Or whatever, I don't know. I, well, I tried. Come on. Give me, <laughs> give, give me a chance. You know what points we're trying? Uh, am I, I still have wood? found zero flint. I actually can't make anything because wow. you need flint to start the game. Okay, this is a little bit of a problem. Oh my god. Spider glands. Oh. Spicy burrito. Okay, I've got oh, loads of monster spicy meat. Burrito. I've got seven monster meat or something. That is good to hear. Yeah, I'm pretty pretty up to date with monster meat, I'll be honest. Mm -hmm. Pretty happy with You're it. Up to date on the monster meat meta? The monster meat meta, that's exactly it. That is exactly it. Oh my god, these petrified fucking things are absolutely terrible. Um, petrified trees? 
Yeah, petr no, not the petrified trees, the spiky trees. They're absolutely terrible. Ah, oh, right. Got them. They're pretty damned abysmal. So, I found a spider forest up here. It's interesting. Okay. That's cool. It just exists. It's, it's worth noting. I've also found some graves up here as well. Uh, a large amount of green caps also, so I can bring sanity back up with uh, cooked green caps. Should that is kind of cool. Alright, so I'm gonna just get a little bit more light. I'm gonna light a tree on fire. Just make sure uh, it's not tent near other trees. A ten well, it is kind of near other trees. A, a tentacle okay. spike? Do I want a tentacle spike? Yes. A tentacle spike is basically like 1.5 times as strong as a normal spear. Although wow. your battle spear might be stronger, but yeah, if you that's have what a I'm thinking. spike, it might be worth me holding it at least. Yeah, uh, well, you know, at least we'll have it. Yeah. Be better it's, to have it than not have it. Ow. What a jerk call. Alright, so I've got four fish, nine monster meat, four meat, and five frog's legs. Awesome. I'm actually on fire. Holy shit. I mean, the, I'm not actually What? On actually on fire? What? Did you stand too well. close to the tree? No, I was I was just joking. I'm not actually on fire. Oh. Mm, good joke. I kind of lied actually there a little bit. That's that's the hallmark of good joke when people go, uh, "What?" <laughs> that's the exact reaction you want. That's that's when comedians know they've really done well. <laughs> when the entire audience just silently reflects upon what they just heard. Yeah. That's that's kind of what I was going for that that whole silent reflection thing, that's yeah. Gold standard, you've got it. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. Yep, All I right, just well, found the desert. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, also, keep an eye out for potential McTusky Tusk. Whatever his uh, yes, fucking name is. Spawn points. Sorry, what? McTusk spawn points. McTusk spawn points. Alright. Or Walrus Camp. Just Walrus Camp is the easiest way to say it. Alright. Alright. No, no need to brag about it. Uh, I'm going to get loads of charcoal. Because I think that that's something that we often leave a little bit too late, actually. Yeah, so... um, I mean, six gets us two crockpots. I found the yeah. beefalo already, by the way. And then next to the desert. So this is where our base is going to be. Beautiful, beautiful, mate. Beautiful. Mike. It's absolutely beautiful, mate. It's uh, a do you need, you're going to, you're going to need pages, actually. So how far away are you? You're not super far away. Uh, Swamp. I'm... That's a pretty big swamp up here, so. Good. Uh, I'm, I'm really pretty optimistic. Um, and you I feel so much. Well. I do need pages very often. Yeah, I feel so, I feel so much more confident exploring the swamp as uh, as Vigfried because literally anybody that comes up to me, have a have a smack, you're going down. Yep. You know, it's it's great. They just like tap him on the nose, like I don't know if you should be doing that, buddy, and they just uh, waddle away or die. Yeah, I mean, maybe, maybe we're, I mean, I know you're probably not, but I'm probably, like, hugely undervaluing the swamp, because you can get tentacle spikes, you can get a whole bunch of stuff. It's kind of cool. I mean, it's, uh, it's, it's like just, yeah. tentacle spikes and reeds. Yeah, that's, that's pretty good. Primary important stuff in swamp. I mean, they're okay. I'm, I'm not a huge fan, personally, of the swamp. I mean, books, like, if we can find a way to keep you sane then you're going to be so unbelievably powerful. Like, that is yeah. bonkers. And that's exciting. I'm excited about the prospects. Interesting. Well, yeah, we are going to be setting up in this um, in this desert. They've got the beefalos down south, and full stop, I guess. But there's also okay. grass geckos around this entire thing, so we're going to have easy access to grass cactus flowers so you can make cactus stew in order to heal everyone sorry flower stew in order to heal everyone so uh, it's good flower stew i don't think i eat flower stew do i eat flower stew well you don't i do well yeah but you know maybe it's not all about you you ever contemplate no, that for a second me. uh i thought so all right um I'm spawning a Qualifant, by the way. That is 100% what you want to be doing, so I'm glad to hear it. Okay. Alright. 
I'm actually just straight up gonna set up our base right now. Just go for it, man. Just go for it. It seems preemptive, but this is a big biome. I just, I, I guess the first thing I'm gonna make sure of is that there aren't any nasty surprises hanging about. It's understandable. Specifically hound mounds. Hound mounds. Mm hmm. Mounds of hounds. There are mounds little, of uh, like, skullish spawn points for hounds. And I would I'll take them out. They not I'll take close them. To the... Well, yeah, you can take, take them out, but we also want to farm them, but I don't want them near the base. Yeah, that's you farm them with the hounds' teeth. It's actually pretty good. Yeah, yeah. That is something that we are going to be wanting. I think we should. I think we should get some traps, um, like as well. Like that seems some pretty teeth cool. Teeth traps, yeah, that's a good idea. Some teeth traps, yeah. Oh no! There's so many people over here, and there's a spider nest nearby. Oh my god! Oh shit! Fuck me. The people who proved to be like worth their weight a thousand times over in gold. Uh, in yeah. the way they handled the problems they're, they're, we were encountering. They're pretty good. They're they're pretty mm. pretty dope. Uh, I I spawned a Qualifant, although it's kind of right in the middle of the Mermen, so I'm not confident that it's going to survive. <laughs> um, so, do the Merms aggro on it? I don't know. They they didn't look like they aggroed on it, but I don't really know. So they might. I didn't think they would, so you should be fine. I mean, I'm not. It's not. Me, I'm not worried about it. I'm not worried about it for my sake. I'm worried about it for the koalafant's sake. Yeah. So, yeah. I've. I've yeah. Do the Do the mermen go into their beds in the evening time? Uh, I don't know when they go to bed. Man, what if what, the mermen are fucking stupid? I'm sorry, but like they're literally living in a biome with tentacles, which oftentimes yep. fucking wreck their faces. Mm -hmm. Like, not even difficult to wreck them. They're even more stupid because they pick a fight with them. They yeah. know that my ancestors, for generations past, have been killed by this specific tentacle spike. <laughs> but I will be the one to cut up now. I'm dying as well. Dang it. <laughs> That's pretty much it. It's a pretty depressing state of affairs, quite frankly. They aren't clever beasts. No, they're not. But then again, neither am I, so who am I to judge? True. Who am I to judge? Okay. Let's hmm, get there's some... also a birch biome up here. Interesting. Oh, I love me some birch biome. I know you hate birch biomes, but mm -hmm. I like love them. I love them a lot. I think they're abysmal. Personally. Yeah, you don't like them. I, I really do. I think they're they're cool as all heck. Oh. <sighs> I can't get any flint, and I just had to watch a mole eat a flint. <laughs> <laughs> that is that is saddening to the extreme, man. How will okay, how I, will you survive? How will I survive? Flint is actually really important. Yeah, I know, right? Well, you know what? Anyway, ladies and gents, I think that's a pretty good place to uh, to wrap up. If, if I don't say so. A lot's happened. A lot's happened in this episode. Fortunately or perhaps unfortunately. Mostly. I'm going to go with unfortunately on that one personally. Alright. Alright. Well, you know what? I I see this as a, a... A big new awakening for us, right? Like, the renaissance of Don't Starve for Raptato, right? Ever the optimist. Yeah, I am. You know? I'm I'm positive. I'm positive that it's it's gonna be great. Uh, yeah, sorry. Uh, yeah, ladies and gents, thank you very much for watching. My name's Anobi Potato. His name's Rhapsody. This has been Don't Starve, and we'll see you next time. Bye.